Hi guys, this is Ankit, your job interview coach and the author of the book One Stop Shop to help land your dream job in your cart. Today in this video, I'm going to talk about applying the biggest marketing strategy of all times in your next job interview. So without any delay, let's get started. Employers don't really want astounding qualifications. Employers aren't looking for an exceptional skill set. They don't really expect an answer for every question asked. None of this really matters to them. So what is it that they are looking for in you? Well, all that they want from you is just a little amount of hope. So if you really wish to impress them in a job interview, then you should learn to apply the biggest marketing strategy of all times which is creating hope for your employer as they want to know whether you will be the right choice for them or not. They want the assurance that you're the one they've been eagerly looking for and their search should ideally end on you. So if you see in a lot of ways they are no different than you. In a way, they want to be heard well. They don't want you to talk over them. They don't want to be lied to. They don't want to be disregarded in any way. In fact, they want to feel inspired. They want to hear a straight and honest reply in the very first attempt itself. They wish to feel like you really, really care. And they even want you to hear what they aren't really saying. So in a way, all that they want from you is that ray of hope. And if you aren't really selling that in your next job interview, then you're probably at the wrong place. Think and Grow Rich, the amazing best-selling book written by Napoleon Hill is the perfect example I would like to relate to in this case. Now, what a lot of people aren't really aware of is that when Hill wrote this book back in 1937, he was completely broke at that time. So imagine a penniless person telling the world the secret to grow rich. Sounds absurd, isn't it? But besides that, it is noteworthy to see what made Hill's book go viral to an extent that he sold over a hundred million copies of it. Any guesses? Well, the answer simply lies in the book's title itself. Think and Grow Rich. You see, he sold hope to people through his title. Imagine how simple does it sounds. All you need to do is just think and that itself will make you rich. He gave the world the biggest hope of all times and ended up selling millions of copies of his book. Now how many people actually became rich by reading his book is a different question altogether. So go ahead and sell hope to your interviewer. Don't just talk about what you have done so far, instead talk about what you will do for them and their company. Don't just talk about your key achievements, instead convey what value adds will you bring along with you. Don't make the mistake of mentioning how being hired by them will turn out to be fruitful for you. Instead, tell them how hiring you will prove to be beneficial for them, their company and their customers. If you succeed in applying this technique well, then the apple is sure to fall in your lap.